Peru says the militant group responsible for one of Latin America's deadliest conflicts killed more than a dozen people over the weekend. On Monday, the justice minister blamed rebels with the Shining Path for a massacre whose victims included children. In the terrorist incursion, the massacre's victims were killed with firearms, fire and other blunt objects. Fourteen people, including two children, were burned. Pamphlets were found at the site of the massacre, telling Peruvians not to vote on June 6. The Peruvian government considers the Shining Path to be a terrorist group. In the 1980s, they led a campaign responsible for the killing of nearly 70,000 people, according to a truth commission. The Shining Path today has dwindled, but has ties to narco-traffickers. The incident over the weekend took place in a region where 75 percent of cocaine is produced in the country. Despite the violence, the Joint Command of Peru's Armed Forces assured that the upcoming election will be secure. But the National Police Commander Cesar Cerrantes warned on Monday that it is likely there will be more deaths. Peru is slated to hold elections in less than two weeks, pitting socialist Pedro Castillo against conservative Keiko Fujimori. Thank you.